Hi everybody and welcome to June's progress report. Progressing on the things we did in May. <laughs> it's been a busy month. Um, the weather has been amazing and then with the rain on top, so everything's been growing. We've had the um, lawnmower out and already it needs cutting again but it is so beautiful when the grass has all been cut. We've had the lawnmower out, the rotavator's been out. We've been weeding, um, planting seedlings. Uh, yeah, it's all of a sudden life has just gone boom. <laughs> Let's get on with it, kind of thing. So yeah, I'll take you um, as a little for a little walk round, um, so you can see, see for yourself. Um, as you can see behind me, this little beautiful. Um, we, put, we planted them actually a few years ago. It's not, we planted them from seed. It was uh, like green manure, but they're beautiful. The flowers, that that flower, and they, they, they're just coming out of the fence. But just there where the archway is, is another plot. Our, our neighbors had that, but they're actually, they're moving out of uh, the area. So they've given up their, their allotment. Now it makes sense to us, um, that we take over that allotment as well. Not necessarily to grow things in because we've seen what the people before, what they grew. And we, we personally just thought it'd be, just maintain it. We get our water from, from down there as well. So it makes sense that we're able to, you know, keep coming through from there. We'll just, it'll be like a wild flower garden and the strawberries down there as well and they're really big so we you know we want to keep what what they've got down there as well keep it all nicely maintained for the water especially with the weather changing as well it's a beautiful warm day today it's quite windy though but yeah it's still really nice i've come down in all honesty i've come down with a packed lunch and not a plan because i'm just i've just been sitting down on the grass uh, breathing, <laughs> enjoying, relaxing, listening to the birds. It's really nice. We don't always come down here to graft really hard, but sometimes there's times where we just need the rest, and I need the rest today, so it's really nice to be here. So yeah, bear with me one second. I'll um, turn the camera around. We'll have a little walk around. I'll take you down to that that plot down there, and. Um, can have a little look round. Okay, bear with me. Uh, I'll just take you through quickly here before I start telling you all about the beds and stuff we've got. This through the archway, this one down here. It's funny really because uh, before we got to know our neighbours, I used to sit on their bench way before we used to have any of this. And they didn't really like us sitting on the bench. But little did we know, da da, I'm going to be sitting on that bench again no one's gonna tell me off so yeah this is the this is the plot we're on about I mean the grass needs cut in so you can't really see where it's all defined into little beds but here here's all the strawberries still weeding bonus that they're leaving the blue bucket the blue uh, watering bucket because obviously we won't need it not costing bit so yeah this is it this is the this is the uh, other part we're going to take over. Just mow the lawn. Yeah. And there, down the bottom there, where we get the water from. So it makes sense, as you can see. And da da! This is ours. That green manure, it looks lovely. I don't know if you can see how beautiful it is there. And that's the way out, but that's not where we're going. <laughs> system for them to grow up. <laughs> it's like 10 green bottles. 10 cans of carrots. Uh, it's to stop the birds. Look, and they're growing quite well. Look. It's climbing up. Up, 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 up. That's what we like to see. There we go. Something through there. Two courgettes. 
and all do is they're growing really well nice and green um a mange too yeah and it, see what i mean we've we've cut all this grass but again it's like a jungle uh, a couple of weeds in there but basically you get not the best they're growing there's loads of stingers around here so Best to have wellies, eh? I like that. Here we go. So our boxes, because of the finest soil needed for the um, carrots to grow, we decided to do them in boxes this year, so we could really, really thin the um, soil out. As you see, these are carrots. There's some more radish in there, but spinach, spinach. It's spinach it makes me laugh every year. My carrots are growing nicely, all uniformed in a little line. The radishes we've already taken actually. There might be a few left in there, but we've already had a harvest of them. They were lush. Still got some left actually, but there we go. Little babies. And to the next row. Potatoes. Here they are, with spinach. Purple spinach, look at them. Potatoes. Kerry's already mounted them up, but they'll need doing again. Definitely. Bless her. We can give her a hand. That's a back-breaking job, that is, when you have to dig up the soil to, to mount them up. And here we go. So this is our onion bed. Onion and potatoes, because as I said, there's potatoes left in there from last year. There we go, there's the potatoes. There's some more in between, in between the weeds as well. Believe it or not, that's not long been down, it's like... We're not a one-trick pony, is it, Reading? As much as we'd like to think it is, but yeah. There's the onion. We've got some big ones growing as well, haven't we? Let's go across here. These are fruit canes and raspberries. Let's have a look. Are they not gooseberries? I can't remember what the name of them was. Oh, that's not good. But anyway, I can't remember the name for the life of me. I can hear Paul telling me now, but. Answers on a postcard. <laughs> That's the only one of that. The rest is all raspberries. And here we have sweet corn. A little bit of it here. I love watching the sweet corn grow last year. They grew really, I mean, I'm only tiny, but they were bigger than me. And the shed, Ooh, who knows? But yeah, this is this is an area where we're thinking about having a pond. Um, be nice, wouldn't it? But we'll see. We'll see what happens. We've got plenty, anyway. Plenty of, to be getting on with. And uh, keep us busy. I just turned around, and there's the bee man. Bees out. I hope they don't all come flying out. Let me move down here. I wonder what he's doing. Anyway, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video uh, and seeing our progress. It is hard work, but it's not hard work. You enjoy it. It's great being out in nature. So anyway, thank you very much for watching our video. Um, bless you. Take care. See you soon. Bye.